As a landlord, it's useful to understand the rights of your tenant. A tenant has the right to quiet enjoyment of a property without being harassed by the owner. Too frequent visits or persistent phone calls by the owner or the property manager on the owner's behalf may constitute harassment. Under these circumstances, a tenant may present the landlord with a giving notice for breach of duty to landlord of rented premises from your tenant notice. In a nutshell, this gives you, the landlord, 14 days to stop the behaviour or the tenants can take out an order against you, forcing you to leave them alone. Your tenants have to be sure that they maintain the premises in the order in which they found them. As a landlord, you have to make allowances for normal wear and tear, but damage over and above this must be paid for by the tenants, either from their pocket or from their bond money, if it's discovered at the end of the tenancy. The tenants must notify you as soon as any damage has occurred and remedy the situation as soon as possible. They must also avoid becoming a nuisance and harassing neighbours. If the landlord doesn't carry out repairs when requested, the tenants can't stop paying rent. They can, however, have a notice issued and ask that the rent be paid into a special account rather than to the owner until the repairs are carried out. When a tenancy agreement is coming to an end, tenants can't stop paying the rent in deference to the bond being held. Tenants must pay rent up until the last day and then apply to have their bond refunded. While tenants will pay for their own electricity and telephone charges, water and council rates are usually paid by the landlord. In some states, the landlord must also foot the bill for excess water charges, although in other states, this is the responsibility of the tenant. Finally, your tenant must advise you who will be living in the property and can't bring in additional or different people unless you agree to this. Your approval can't be unduly withheld. Next time, I'll cover a few more of your tenant's rights and in the meantime, pop onto your state's consumer website and download a copy of the Tenant's Rights Handbook. Mm -hmm.